Oh my god, my camera, my camera. <laughs> Oh, I love this part. So clear. Now, for those of you without a village, I don't know how you cope with life. When it hits you in the city, where do you go? You go on vacation? Ah, I prefer mine in my village. Seriously. This is rice, okay? And this is exactly what it looks like. Let me go closer. For those of you that have not seen rice before, uh, this is what rice looks like uh, right in the farm. We are at the final stage. Farm, okay. <laughs> okay, so guys, welcome back to another interesting village video. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Lillian, and currently I'm in my village at the south south part of Nigeria. I'm still here and I like to share some of the things I can put out in public and I like to share with you guys. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscription button. Don't forget to like this video. All right. So we are going to harvest cassava that I will take with me to Ghana. I, want, I love the feeling of making gari by myself. It helps me to feel so safe knowing that that gary is actually as clean as i would have done it if it is if it was done by me so anytime i come to the village i like to seize the opportunity to process gary by myself quite inconveniencing to travel with load but i don't mind i, I tell you i lie you not apart from the fact that i can actually get all these things where i live i love that safety that i feel uh whenever i process gary by myself okay so if you have um, watched some of my videos of me in my village you may have stumbled on a video of me telling you guys that it is almost compulsory to own a farm around your house in my village a farm of farms is a very common thing is a tradition with the ukele people of the northern part of cross river state in nigeria is a common thing with us to see farms around the house so today we are harvesting in one of the farms and my sister came around and she's the one filming so she was telling me i'm being too slow but i don't think so don't mind her I think uh -huh. she thinks i'm slow <laughs> so she offered to give a helping hand and which i didn't mind truth be told a lot of people usually get surprised when they see me walking at the farm even my mom i don't understand like i was born here raised here like i grew up here not this particular compound this place here we are new here my mom recently um we moved to this place new okay our village village <laughs> which is inside there eh? that was where i grew up now so i used to go to the farm i used to do everything that other people do but anytime i come home and i'm walking in the farm everybody will act like they are surprised and some of them will act like they, they do better than me just like my younger sister this is antonia's mother if you are following my channel well you know there's a child that lives with me she's my sister's daughter i've always said so so this is her biological mother she feels like i'm being slow yeah slow but surely i will get to the bottom of it so <laughs> all right so let's keep going harvest 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 and um just a little while my mom joined me my mom do not trust my ability to do this thing alone okay i need her though but i can actually do it even if she did not offer me any help ha <sighs> these people are playing with me but it's fine um i've i've created that impression like i've tried to correct that impression that i'm not afraid of farm work okay it's not something i want to do because i don't have all that i don't have a choice but i would like to own a farm just for the sake of like i want to do it you know so yeah after harvesting it i brought it back here to come and peel and my amazing mama is helping me <laughs> my mom loved to help me i swear she loved to give me a helping hand even though we fight a lot that part you don't want to see because i and my mama we have the same personality okay so we disagree a lot because we are almost the same my mom is don't worry <laughs> story for another day 
my mom and I can argue a mountain. All right, so peeling, 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 and I just love the fact that I'm doing this organically. I know what is in there. I know how to do it. And after um, after peeling it like this, what I wanted to do is take it to the stream to go wash it and bring it back. But they felt like I was doing too much. So I had to like listen to my mama because trust me, we've argued like five times today at the cost of doing this cassava. <laughs> If you can relate, comment down below. You know, you see a child that takes after you and you'll be happy. Uh, but you don't know that you and that child will argue a lot. That's me and my mom. So after peeling, I couldn't convince my mom to allow me to take the cassava to the stream to go wash. So um, I sent somebody to help me get water from the stream. So I am... Um, taking it to go and wash right now you know just here because the guy that will be grinding it has has come in fact he even came a bit too early so he was even giving a helping hand so we can finish for those of you that don't know how to process gary i am your auntie in this business okay so now let's wash please i want to let you know that there is no soap inside this um this thing this cassava okay i did not add any detergent all right no no uh, toxic chemical in case you are concerned because you're seeing a sponge okay i just wash it like this and just to scrub it so that all the dirt can be washed off easily okay so let's keep doing that let's keep doing that and um the guy that is going to grind it is already standing by and the next thing is to grade it okay all right so the next thing is this and i i just love the process and i'm i'm glad i was able to document it my mom came prize it and now we have they have agreed and we're going to grant it my mom can price something so i was telling her she, she cheated the guy and she got angry <laughs> that i should pay she told the guy to collect double from me so i don't i don't know i felt like the money was too small <laughs> the money they offered to pay uh due to the fact that fuel is quite expensive i don't know why i'm laughing a lot a lot about this video but i love the whole process okay and uh, you don't want to know how many hours i slept you know before i continued okay i slept um for some time because i was tired okay all right so i'm going to do everything myself pack it into the machine for the guy to grade for me after this is my cameraman okay this guy have been amazing my little nephew so now this is how we do the yellow gary my mom is going to add or oh, you can see her adding oil already i paid for, <laughs> i paid for this oil <laughs> ah my mom so my mom uh, added the oil half bottle of um oil and then mix 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 and mix 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 I added more left for me i would have used a whole bottle i'm so sorry you see this i get over i do overdo sometimes when i'm doing things like this so my mom added a bit of um no yeah okay a bit this is almost a bit so she added and added and added mix 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 and packets all right so that cassava was quite small to have given us this much right this is how we carry cassava it kind of swell after a while especially after after grinding it and just when we were there my best friend came around because she heard I'm, I'm back so stay tuned don't go nowhere because we are going to the stream after this hi so you hear stomach looking like that i don't understand come and embrace me jerry keep the camera bestie oh you have food <laughs> All on you, Jesus is love. Why are you so big? Jesus is love. See, hand. No, do me like that. You person no fine you come when I know they say she they come now you accept now.
on the day on today's episode of spending the day with me in my village i want to wash okay so <laughs> i didn't want to bring the whole soup to the river or to the stream rather so i took some and i don't know if it's going to be enough so you you to the adventure of the ninja people washing let's pack this up into the bucket and set it aside so i actually brought my body wash so i'm going to take my bath but i'm waiting i met someone here so when he's when he's done and he's he leaves i'm gonna shower don't go nowhere okay oh my god my camera my camera my camera oh my camera <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> mm. <laughs> ah, my so clear I feel so peaceful like I swim and had my head deep into that water and I found for those of you without a village I don't know how you cope with life when it hits you in the city where do you go you go on vacation ah I prefer mine in my village seriously Like I showed you guys in one of my videos, the first video of me in my village. This is rice, okay? And this is exactly what it looks like. Let me go closer. For those of you that have not seen rice before, uh, this is what rice looks like right in the farm. We are at the final stage of it, where they are going to harvest, you know, the last stage of it. So, a crew. Yeah, get feel so much at peace hmm? so now we have come to the end of the um, a day in my life or a day in my village okay stay tuned and see what next i have to do here while we are still in the village Let